muted. Of course I am. <laughs> Harboring the last survivors of the human race. Excellent. Blah, blah, blah. They train day and night, confined to their hideout. That legacy curse, survival, their sole purpose. A legend warns of the demon army, bound to strike again, eager to completely eradicate humans. Fortunately, legend also tells of a hero flying in from the Western Ocean to bring protection and knowledge. On a day that begins like so many others, a young ninja is about to be visited by the Western hero. And sent on a perilous journey into this merciless world to carry a scroll paramount to the clan's survival. Yeah, I thought I had unmuted myself already, and then I look over and it's still muted. It kind of sucks, but hello, Aura. Um, let's see. I don't think there's many options. Wait, what key do I even? Wait, what key are we using here? A oh, space. Uh, pixel perfect resolution. What does that mean? I'm not sure what that means. <laughs> uh, up, down, left, right, jump space. Uh, rope darts, left alt. Okay, attack, left control. Okay, that's an. Hmm. I don't know if I like these buttons. Can I change this? Jump is fine, but inventory uh, inventory is fine. Um. Uh, Control is such a awkward thing. And alt as well. Those two. I don't know what to put it as though. Because I, I can do like this, I guess. Oh wait, was this? this X? Uh, I, I guess like this, maybe? I don't know. We'll see how it goes. I can change it during the game. My name. Yes. That is actually my name, yes. <laughs> Hi Bennett. Hope you're doing well. Another day and still no sign of this so-called Western hero. Training used to be fun. All we do now is memorize boring prophecies. Demon army this, magic scroll that. Nothing's happening in Hamilton centuries, so why are we still hiding? Wish I could just leave this place and go explore the world. How am I doing? I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Start a new game. Uh, really hoping this will be good. <laughs> but I don't know. We'll see. Uh, gather around everyone, history lesson is about to begin. Oh great, another lecture. I guess I should at least show up this time. So we're in the game. So that's our sword slashing. I guess we can't use the other things yet. 
because shift doesn't work. No, the key, just the attack one works. No. I guess I can't go in the house then. Right on time to try the new course. Show us your cloud step technique. Jump, hit, jump. Interesting. So you can only double jump when you... Hmm. Cool. I like that. thing um, at the top right. Okay. Well, look who decided to grace us with their presence. Have you done your reading? Ever the rebel? What's the point? All we do is rot in this hideout anyway. I see that the importance of our ancestors' wisdom is lost on you. But let me assure you that the threat of the demon army is very real, and should they... Well... Zero to 100 very quickly. <laughs> huh. They have returned! This is all wrong. The western hero was supposed to save us. Watch out! Well, everyone is dead. Great. Don't go. You are not ready. I mean, I have to go. Really. Um. Hmm. Burn it all. Bring the humans to their knees. Not so fast, big boy. But who might you be? Are you really all they've got? Pathetic. Prepare to die. That sound. Impossible. Oh, it's the Western hero. There he is. It's a bit late, but you know. Fashionably late. Let's see whose luck is with you this day. Fazel. Yes, my king. Keep an eye on this worm. Certainly, my king. Count your blessings, ninja. My minions will make short work of you in the autumn hills. Are you... the western hero? Something like that. To be honest, I got here way too late. As you look like the most capable around here, I have a task of the utmost importance for you. Take this scroll and carry it across the island. You need to reach Glacial Peak's summit, where three sages will be waiting for you. But who are you, and why is this scroll important? You'll find answers along the way. Head for the village gate now. The Shroud of Night will be your only protection to make it through the Autumn Hills. Godspeed, messenger. I think I'm going to lower the volume slightly. It's a little bit too loud for me. Chosen to be the messenger, tasked with, the carry with carrying the scroll across the cur your cursed world. Yay. Um, great, I guess. So, demon invasion and everything. It's not the best start of your day, I guess. Mm. 
well. be a bit more careful. Messenger, I wasn't expecting you so soon. What is this place? This is the shop. It doesn't look like a shop. Do I look like a shopkeeper? Anyway, so I'm this mystic character who will be mentoring and supporting you on your epic quest to save the world. All you need to do is take the scroll to the top of, the, of a faraway mountain where three stages from my order will be waiting for you. Your, your order was so slow down. It was way too much sex for one dialogue box. Look, just Keep going eastward and make sure you grab all these time shards you see lying around. I can use them to upgrade your abilities and artifacts. Don't blame the messenger? No. Never blame the messenger. Don't shoot the messenger. Don't hurt the messenger. It's just the messenger. <laughs> but I, I surround them. First one is on the house. Enjoy. We've got the climbing claws. Press against walls while airborne to stick to them. Nice. Um, let's see. So, what about the climbing claws? Climbing claws? Oh, yeah, you can press against the wall to cling to them and climb with your laser. Makes sense. The way everything looks, it, look, it just felt like I should be able to do that. <laughs> yes, that's why John Guiden invented them decades ago. <laughs> the, the, the fourth wall does not exist, I think. Hi Tay. The fourth wall just non-existent. Oops. Um, wait, how do I go back to game? <laughs> Who's John Guiden? Never mind, just an acknowledgement I need to get out of his way. <laughs> I don't get it. Somewhere. So what is this place? Where are we? Curious, are we? In time you will come to realize that the question is not where, but when. That's it? Listen, I know you're still new to this, but you have to be pretty naive to expect anything other than cryptic information so early in the adventure. <laughs> what is this game? I like this. Wouldn't you rather go back into the action anyway? Just buy a health upgrade or something and be on your way. Kiss these days. <laughs> Any stories to share? Of course, here's one for you. I once was a servant who didn't know how to read. The day came where his master asked him to read something for her, to which he replied, I'm sorry my lady, I can't read. That reply immediately got him fired. So he went out into the streets looking for a tea house to relax and accept the bad news. When he couldn't find any, he reckoned he probably wasn't the only one to wish there was a tea house in this small town, so he opened up his own. It really picked up, so he built many more and became rich in the process. One day his accountant asked him to review a piece of a document to which he replied he didn't know how to read. The accountant, who couldn't believe his ears, said if he became a millionaire without even knowing how to read, just imagine where he would be if he could read. Oh, I know exactly where I would be, the rich man replied. I would be a servant. Yeah. Oh, I don't see how this applies to my adventure. It doesn't. You ask for a story. <laughs> More like the long version of when life gives you lemons. Um, Alright, since you don't seem to appreciate me sharing some clever material for your next party, I should just move on. Uh, I like this guy. The shopkeeper. Okay, so what do we have? We have the health upgrade he was talking about. So just one extra HP. Um, power to attack. 
letting you destroy enemy projectiles. You can even cloud st step off of them. That sounds really good, actually. Being able to destroy the projectiles would help a lot. Uh, let's get out of here. So now we can climb. Come on, really? Did I just... Already getting a lot of pieces out of that. Wait, can I just walk through here now? So far, so good. Underwater section. I really like the music. Oh, I need to... Interesting. space to swim up. Oh, and we have another, another shop. Hello again. Um, uh, so we can get shurikens. I think I want the health upgrade for sure, and then the shurikens. Okay, and then I probably want these upgrades, but they're expensive. They're quite expensive. Now we have shurikens. That I just wasted <laughs> because you know. Yeah. Okay. So I can jump off of those things as well. <laughs> oh, that's so silly. Oh no. 
first time is good. Come on, really? <laughs> no, not again. I think I need to jump from this. down here. Oh. Oh, what's this? So it seems you're one to wander off the beaten path. What was that big green object? Oh, you mean that thing you just smashed instead of collecting? It's a power seal. There are many others like this one, but to be honest, I'm not really sure what they do. I can tell you that finding them all is optional, but if you're the kind of adventure that likes to go for the extra challenge, you want to keep an eye out for hidden rooms. And who knows, it may or may, may not unlock an overpowered upgrade. Anyway, I'll be in my shop. are breakable, but I can't hit down. I do want an overpowered upgrade. That sounds really nice. But... How come you had to kill a bunch of enemies and this guy just teleports? Because he's a shopkeeper, right? He's just mysterious and always around for some reason. Who knows? Nope. Damn you respawning enemies. I wish I could just teleport. That would make, that make this game so much easier. I don't have to go through all these enemies and things. could just teleport to my destination, deliver the message and be done. You know? But no, we have to do it the hard way. takes care of the shop here basically has turn. <laughs> oh we have a new chat level boss looks like we're almost at the end of this area did i forget to mention there's a giant leaf monster guarding the exit you did haha <laughs> that look on your face don't worry dear adventurer leaf monsters only come out during a full moon oh is the full moon right now yes oh that's i i didn't mean to well good luck Let's get that. This is last one. Underwater dash. Okay. Aerobatics warrior. What? Devil's do.
Oh, well. Leave monster. Here we go. First boss. Oh. oh, I think I understand. customer what happened i almost died at just there strictly speaking you did hmm? but how my name's barbel barbel at your service i am the one you never would have met had you owned any skills <laughs> wow um thanks the gist of it is, I have a magic ring that allows me to control space and time, so whenever you're about to die, it will appear to stop everything and teleport you back to the latest checkpoint. Okay, what's the catch? Well, for one, you will still feel agonizing pain every single time. Also, I'm keeping track of your death in my little notepad, so I'll stick around to steal your loot until either we're even or I am bored. I mean, I can let you die if you prefer. Seems we have a deal. At least I die. Carry on then. Why did I die the first time? The Forlorn Temple. Uh, we don't actually have any money to spend here, but maybe yes. Oh, wait. What's this with this big mysterious chest? It appeared when you smashed your first power seal. You still need to smash 44 power, se power seals to open that? 44? 44? <laughs> Forlorn Temple, huh? That's a sad one. How so? Haven't paid much attention during history, history lessons, have you? Adventurer types rarely do, I get it. So the short of it is, that four-headed monster would, would have killed you earlier if that cool, cooler than you hero hadn't intervened. That's the Demon King. He brought his armies to the human realm many centuries ago and destroyed their stronghold, forcing them to retreat into hiding. And he's been sitting on their throne ever since. You mean this is all that is left of the human legacy? For what it's worth, I'm sorry. No way! I will go down and take that demon king right now. Oh, I will go and take down the demon king right now. You wouldn't be the first to try. Well, I can't just stand by while some evil monster gloats over my people's misery. You're still too weak to consider you taking on even this second in command. I'm going. I bet you can't even make it to the ent entrance without falling into the pit. Watch me. Oh, I will. Yeah, dude, it's just the demon king. Yeah, J just the king of all demons. What can he really do? So... 
he was right. <laughs> Shopkeeper guy was right. Oh, you scared me. I thought you were an undead. What kind of creature are you? You've never seen a folking? Folkin? We are a tribe of builders, technically very hard working, but every one of us is cursed by a unique fear, which we are named after. What's your name? Necro. Necro? So you fear the dead and somehow ended up in the catacombs? Ironic, isn't it? I fell while trying to repair the temple ruins above and was instantly paralyzed by all this morbidity. Anyway, thanks for stepping me out of it. I really need to get back to work. True, I am a ninja. Demons should be fine. Should be able to handle them. This guy. Why does it have to be like this? Sending all his undead friends at me. Why are you like this? I don't. Do I trust this water? <laughs> choice though. So. 156. I don't think that's enough. I need a 200, right? Yeah. I can get the underwater dash. I don't think I care enough for that though. Talk about the Demon King. Hey, how did that epic raid on the Demon King go? Did you manage to save the world and restore your people's honor? It's not fair, the bridge was in shambles. Well, we wouldn't have much of an adventure if you faced off against a big villain right away, that would be. I mean, he is correct, it would be a bit of a short adventure. a seal thing. Oh god. one gone. This game at least seems to be a lot more forgiving than Ninja Gaiden. Yeah. I 
But then, then again, this is the start. They might just end up going going crazy later on. Who knows? They do seem to give a lot of health pickups and things. There wasn't a lot of that during the good old days of Ninja Kaiden. really using my shurikens at all. I wasn't sure if there would be something there. <laughs> Don't know how I ever had the patience to get g good at games back on the NES. Sure, I've gone from game worse at games as I get older. I I wanted to read it, game. Come on, why did you skip it? Um, but yeah, I can. I can see that. Like, I don't know if I've gotten worse at games necessarily, but it, I do know that I did like a lot of things that nowadays I'm like, how did I even do that back in the day? When I now struggle with it, um, especially like um, Super Girls and Ghosts on the uh, SNES. I never really finished that, even as a kid, but still I got farther than I thought I would. <laughs> because that, that game is really unforgiving. I don't know if you know the game, probably, but you have your armor and then you're, you're basically one hit and you're dead. And if you fall into a pit or anything, also you're dead. Um, but then if you, if you at any point die, you just go back to the start of the game. And it's quite long. <laughs> I did all right, I think. But then you see a speedrun of it and you're like, I knew nothing. <laughs> I was terrible. But speedruns of any game just make me feel bad. <laughs> because this is how speedruns work. Yeah, that's the main thing. You didn't have as many games, so it's just like, yeah, I'll just play this one game and become really good at it because I don't really have any other games to play, so... Oops. 
thought I still had invincibility frames. I did not. Damn it! I messed up. Ooh, going into the spikes made me lose three health out of six. Checkpoint, I'm assuming. Why can't I touch the cabinet? Come on. I'm assuming the boss is nearby. Uh, let's get this. I believe you've reached the necromancer's doorstep. Any advice? Very little is known about this villain. Okay, so no advice. Dodging anything that looks like evil magic would be a good start. Wow, great help. Well, I also recommend looking at my inventory for any useful upgrades. I really appreciate all the support. Look, the necromancer is a newcomer. All we know for now is that he plans on taking over the world with his undead army. All we know? Sorry, I meant I. All I know. I'm totally on my own here. I don't. I don't trust him. I don't trust him. I think he's lying. So we have items. But I, I mean, I already know this. The scroll, the climbing claws, and shuriken, cloud staff, like ninja and second wind. Let's just do this. We done necromancer. And with this army of undead, everyone will soon fear the mighty Ruxton. Hmm. What now? We have a visitor. I don't have time for visitors. Well, he seems to have time for you. Oh great, just when I when you think you get to play with the evil lab. Do I have to remind you who's in charge here? Now say something threatening and try not to embarrass us like you did last time. Oh, I've been practicing. Watch this. Who dares enter my lair? Uh, oh, is that, is that the messenger? Looks like it. What do we do? Steal the scroll, of course. Good plan. On guard, face the mighty might of Ruxton the Great. <laughs> oh. Get out of there. Imagine not being able to hit the projectile. Oh wait, I, I see. So I hide under that thing. I 
should have him. Is my camera actually it's kind of in the way of things isn't it i don't know where to put it maybe i should just put it on the right top frame you won't be able to see my currency but i think that's better than not being able to see part of the like the doors and things. I yield. Wait, I don't. It's over. This evil thing is clearly not working for out for us. No matter how many skulls, skulls we slap onto ourselves. Any suggestions then? I'm listening. I don't know, just something else. Like what? Introspection would be a good start. What has all this brought us, really? Ridiculous, I'm sticking to evil. Oh yeah? And how are you going to accomplish anything if I'm not carrying you? Well, yeah, I, I could. That's... Yeah, that's a good point, actually. It's settled then. Carry on, messenger. We promise not to cause the world any harm. Okay. Well, they seem like nice, nice guys, right? Someone tell you that was a secret passage? My brother used to do that. <laughs> My brother used to do that a bit too. No, that's a secret, that's a secret. This reminds you might remind me of the Medusa head. Hello? 
Ni... No. Sir. Who was that guy? Why does that seem like a, a path you can go? Bamboo Creek. That must be a sight for sore eyes after your trek in the catacombs. Sure is. If you make the best of it, this place is as close to a day off as you'll get on this adventure. I'll try. I just didn't know something so cheerful existed. Huh. I guess that says more about your mindset than about the world. About time shards. What are these crystals I'm collecting? So you're a touch the unidentified magic object first and ask questions later kind of guy. They're time shards. I can use them to augment your abilities. How does it work? Exactly the way we have been doing it so far. You select what you want and give me the required amount of shards so you can do my thing. I meant the spell itself. It's complicated. But I'm curious. I'm busy. <laughs> he doesn't want to tell me anything. Oh wait, shit. Why did I think I could jump through there? I thought I could go, could go down there. No, I can't. Oh shit. <laughs> well, I can. It's just back where I was. Oops. Oh, 
one. <laughs> what am I doing? Oof. I'm really glad I had some recovery there. If I didn't have that upgrade, I would be dead. I think I can... a bit longer than I intended. I was watching someone play Phasmophobia last night and they took ages to find a room. My wife and I are so much better basically fear makes us efficient. Fear does a lot of things. Um, strangely enough. I feel like I should use shurikens more. I keep saying that and then I don't. <laughs> Another boss. So I guess the boss is up next. A boss in Bamboo Creek. That's a good one. Well with the layout, you know, perfectly centered gates, symmetrical lanterns. Symmetrical lanterns, no scrolling, I just thought, look, you're perfectly free to hallucinate patterns and try to make sense of them, but I believe I told you this place was like your day off. So, well, would you fight a boss on your day off? Exactly. Do you think there's actually no boss, or... Is there actually a boss and he just doesn't know about it? There you go. So there's a ledge there to the right. I don't think I can make that jump though. Hmm.
There really isn't. There really isn't. Nice. This air would do something. I guess I was wrong. Unless I fell in the pit. That you did. That gap is way too wide. There's no way I can make the jump. It reminds me of a story. A long time ago, warriors of the Squirrel Clan invented a way to soar through the skies. Touching on a freedom humans could seldom dream of. Some would mis mistake them for gods. Incredible. Yeah, whatever. Here's the wingsuit. <laughs> sure. Thanks. We. I missed it. There you go. I can't let the single the time shards get missed. So I can kill them with shurikens. It seemed that there would be. I th I thought there would be as well. <laughs> the, the boss. Like, okay, yeah, this is the room there would be, but there's nothing here. <laughs> oh my god. Clearly they've never heard of Don't Shoot the Messenger. Clearly. those things while using the wings is oh god it's not easy Mm. 
Kill everything. Destroy it all. safe again. So what is this thing in this cage? Why do you have like a Cthulhu-esque creature in the cage? Let's talk about the wingsuit. Thanks for the wingsuit. You bet. Don't forget to try it out by pressing and holding space while airborne. Why was it free and not the other upgrades? Because it was mandatory to your progression. You can't save the world if you're stuck in a pit. Will there be more previews in the future? There's only one way to find out now, isn't there? What do you mean? I mean you should carry on with your quest while letting your heart know for sure that this was this here cursed world and its inhabitants have a lot of surprise left in store for you. Hmm. We'll see while gliding with the wings you to attack downwards. Yeah, let's get that. So now we can actually do this more easily. so far. Nice. Secret. anything? What about the level boss? Well, I hope you're up for a challenge. Why? Because something big is up next. What? Well, let's just say you're about to fight someone who understands that the best defense is a good defense. Who? I wish I could tell you. 
Anyway, your three questions are up. Carry on. Since when is there a three questions rule? Hey, that's four now. Shuriken's pure target? Yeah. Yeah. Let's go for that. Oh. He's definitely big. Hello, good sir. taking damage there. I mean, I, I know why I was taking damage there, but I couldn't really get out. Not very well. Hard time getting. Wait, why do I have a hard time with that one? It really shouldn't be that difficult. <laughs> I keep being too far away. I thought I could um, go down by using the... By using down and jump at the same time, right?
Don't patronize me, demon, demon guy. Don't patronize me. <laughs> There's a second phase, yeah. I wasn't expecting it. Get him. Get him. Yay. Like, thanks for destroying my golem. Well, you attack me first. What are you talking about? I've been digging through these caverns for centuries and you just randomly engaged. No way. Way. No way. You know what? Fair enough. You see how you could have thought I was a threat. I guess my survival instincts kicked in a little too fast. I understand, it's it's all good. Look, I'm sorry I destroyed the golem, okay? Don't worry about it. I mean I mean it, I'm sorry. It's alright, honest mistake. So how do I get out of here? Oh I'll adjust the wind for you. Good luck on your quest. Thanks, my dude. What friendly bosses. I do as well, yeah. That's great. I guess that's the thing.
How can I make that? Can I make that jump? Oh. I can if I do that. And then... Hmm. Not quite. Spiky mushrooms. I don't like spiky balls either. <laughs> I'd visit that shopkeeper from time to time. Eight deaths is a bit worrying. What are you talking about? Eight isn't that bad. I don't think. Sure, I died to stupid things. But... I think everyone dies to stupid things once in a while, especially with a game like this. Why did I... Don't think they carry awareness upgrades. You bastard, don't... <laughs> He's not very nice, is he? Can at least comfort me when I die, but no. He has to be think about it. How are you doing? You're welcome. To me dying a lot in this game probably. <laughs> Getting hit more than I should. Can you not? Okay. Doing alright? That's good. This crumble's fine for saving your life by 50%. Hmm. I think I want the health upgrade. Let's talk about the Emerald Golem. I still can't believe you defeated the Emerald Golem. Did you get a chance to understand its motive? That thing wasn't evil, it was just digging away. What? You mean all these messengers that were killed? All a misunderstanding. Wow. 
all a misunderstanding. It just happens. Why did I go down this way? Okay. I got quite a few of them anyway. It's good enough. Just so you can't say I'm always negative, go messenger, you can do it. Uh -huh. This is sometimes nice. Sometimes. Wait, I'm almost dead already. Never mind, okay. We're, we're back. Back in business. One was a health pickup. Oh well. Now I know, I guess. A bit late. Why did I even go there? What? <laughs> Thanks for touching those spikes, man. What? How do I... What? Like, how do you even not get hit there? Impossible, right? Am I missing something? What are those things floating? They're like little bones that I can hit to jump off of. So like with the fireballs for example, I can hit them and then jump again. Well, me showing that just got me killed. <laughs> uh, oh. Look, it doesn't matter. I'm 
not keeping a score for deaths. I mean, the game is, but I'm not. always have been. <laughs> Everything is mushrooms. Okay, we have 420. Nice. Um, so let's get that health upgrade. What's the boss? Be careful, I sense a fallen up ahead. A fallen? It's how we call messengers whose quests came to a tragic end, their power corrupted by demon magic. Why are you so serious all of a sudden? Because it doesn't get any more serious than a rogue messenger about to, to unleash on you. And with these stories about a monk, if it really is that one monk... What are you talking about? How about you meeting your match? Good luck. We're fighting another messenger. Well, well, well. Seems we have an intruder. We need to get out of here. This place is filled with monsters. Oh, did my quill shroom scare you? So it's true. <laughs> Don't like my army? It's a shame, really, since you're about to join it. Wait, that scroll. It couldn't be. No, impossible. Kneel before your queen and reserve to receive the curse of quills. Curse of quills? Oh, thank you, Kai. How was your stream? I will give you a shout out after this. I don't want to be in my shoe. Being a lurk? Have a nice lurk. Can I? How's it going? It's going. I mean, I want to say well, but not really. <laughs> Hard time with this boss. Oof. Why do I feel like you meant to do that? I didn't. I didn't mean to do that. Avoid that whip. I don't I don't want to get whipped. Ow. 
Damn it. This is really annoying to find. I want to keep hitting her, but I can't because the way they... she whips me before I can really do anything. Like I have to move away, but then I can't hit her, and the fight takes forever. I don't know what to do about that. I don't want to be in my room. What if I am a mushroom? Tricky. Getting tricked. Oh no, she's coming. Oh, okay, well, never mind. Wasn't a good trick. <laughs> she's she whipped me. Okay. accept the mushroom way of life? No, I don't want to accept the mushroom way of life. Okay, this is not working. sure about this either but they said it was I was better than the outdated lives and continue system <laughs> I mean I, I do think he's better than that be a mushroom I don't mind Quite work, does it? be a mushroom. Sixteen deaths prevented. Quarrel VM MVP. VMP. Uh, why? I couldn't quite hit the hit the thing. I don't know why. Around, do this, boom. 
Kommandant. Let's be a mushroom again. For a very short time. I, I think every time you, you get transformed into a mushroom, it lasts a bit longer. second who do you think you are i'm kobo Kobo? this name makes no sense why have i never seen you before i was exiled a long time ago when i got cursed along with my messenger that voice are you out of here you bet see you sucker hmm Well then. Just getting a bit of health back. So we might see her again, I guess. Because if she has a demon that can turn back time as well. Then she won't actually be dead, right? Congratulations, you made it to the base of the mountain. Almost there. Do you know what this means? I don't know, what, does it mean you have another dialogue trap for me? What? Oh, so you're just going to try and steal my character like that? I guess you think you deserve a prize? No? Well, you do. Plus, you will never be able to make the climb without the rope dart. The rope dart? Don't overthink it. Everyone will probably end up calling it a grappling hook anyway. Here. Proceed to throw. Ring, slender enemies. Okay, nice. Um, monk. I want that monk. It is as I feared. Our most promising messenger did not die, but was instead cursed forever. She became the queen of quails. How did that happen? This is a tale for another time. Okay, wh what about the rope dart? Oh, did you think that was an awkward interaction? You could say that. Do you never had to tell your boss that your little experiment went wrong, permanently impacting one of your colleagues? Hey, I heard that. Anyways. You can use stone rings, lanterns, walls, and enemies. Go nuts! Okay. Let's see what happens. Alright. Awesome. Wow, okay. <laughs> How did I even mess that up?
Oops. My mistake. I didn't mean to do that. Stop telling me that I did that on purpose. Definitely not on purpose. <laughs> Definitely not on purpose. <laughs> or was that one on purpose? Um, maybe it was. Who knows? I can imagine this game being really good for speedrunning. It's my own mistake, right? Oh well. What's this? What's this? <laughs> I say just before I die. Is this one of those power shield things? Probably. Let me let me try to do this. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, that was a bit too close. That was a bit a bit too close for comfort. I did not like how close I was. going to be a surprise boss.
Damn it! No! No! <laughs> there you go, okay. This is the part for the level boss. Looks like the boss is up. Surely you mean the bosses. Bosses? Bosses. The bosses are up. I need to fight more than one boss here. Well, technically it's more like personal training than an actual fight. What? Oh, don't let me ruin it. Go see for yourself. What? What does that even mean? Another day, another stew simmering. Oh yeah. Mountain life is a blast, but I miss seeing adventures pass by. I hear ya. Remember humans? You bet I do. They were almost as interesting as obvious foreshadowing. Oh look, a human. Who would have thought? <laughs> Yo, Colos, check this little guy out. Whoa, Caesar, see that scroll? Hey little guy, are you the carrier? Don't be little. Be, don't be silly, Caesar. Everyone knows it's the runner. You're confused, Carlos. I'm pretty sure it's the envoy. No, you're mis misconstrued, Caesar. It's actually the emissary. Come on, Carlos. I think I remember it being the courier. Seriously, Caesar. How about we agree on the message bearer? Can can do, Carlos. Want to test the message bearer's sportsmanship? I thought you'd never ask, Caesar. Let's see what you've got, little guy. What? How did... <laughs> what? <laughs> How strong do you have to be to do that? To jump up towards that tower? Using your arms. Oh god. I can't hurt him. So you have accum accumulated 221 time shards so far. It's hmm. a lot of time shards I've lost. Oh well. It happens.
guy. Come on. Oh, he's angry. Steam out of his ears. avoid that wrong. Oh shit. I mean, I, I do know how to avoid it, just not how to avoid it. Well... <laughs> when I'm close to him. Oh, come on. That was an easy dodge. Are you playing with mid and stuff? What do you mean? It wasn't that easy to dodge that one. You bastard. Uh. Uh. Okay. That wasn't the attack I wanted to see. Hit that guy from behind. Looks like. So I can just get behind him and just start hitting him like this. Okay, how do I avoid this? How do I avoid it? Is that controller functioning properly? I'm not using a controller here. Yeah, yeah. It's a keyboard. I don't know how to avoid that one. I just don't. Really? Oh 
sure I jumped over. Right when I was about to jump over him. Twenty five deaths. What a game. So <laughs> we really don't know how to avoid that one. Not all the way at least. there. Very flashy right now. Got him. Confounded Kolos. The postman packs quite a punch. Savily stated, Susan. We like you, little guy. What do you reckon, Colos? He probably needs to reach the top of the mountain. Seems so, Suzes. I say we help out. Confirm, Colos. Let's do this. Thanks for the workout, little guy. Now don't move. This might sting a little. Wait, what? Ready, Colos? Set, Suzes. Hut. Well, I'm hungry now. Shall we snack, Colos? <laughs> snack. <laughs> I just sent Suzes. We promised not to eat until our power thistle was ready to be added to the pot. I forgot completely, Carlos. Surely its magical properties will make us even stronger. It will be succulent, Susus. It will be concarn, Coolus. Carlos. Let's sit by the stew until this thistle is fully grown. <laughs> okay then. Of course it's ice. Why would there not be ice in a game like this?
How do you even... There's a ring over there. How do you even get there? Levels are getting quite a bit difficult. More difficult than they were previously. frozen. Why did I... Why did I do that? I could have just gone to the checkpoint. I could have just gone to the checkpoint. Instead I tried to gamble with my, <laughs> my one health. It did not pay off. your eyes. Why are you so slippery?
Okay. Get back. Got the checkpoint, and now we can do this. There you go. One of these days. I'll actually be good at this. <laughs> no. Lapis, Mongoose, Digitonis, Faust, Unifortune. Hi everyone. Uh, let's do this. There you go. I knew you were playing Fall Guys. This is all good. Of it. Did you actually get a win in the end still? Because um, I only saw you lose. <laughs> on uh, Fall Mountain. We did get a win. We got a pity win, Suspense. Hmm. I'm not sure if I trust Spouse or not. That is a pity win. I need this. Ah, oh, we got a health. Good. Good. Yeah, this is um, the messenger. Very much inspired by Ninja Gaiden. We are just the messenger. We need to get a scroll to some people that is supposed to save the world. Supposedly. And uh, we're fighting people on the way because. You know, everyone wants to stop us, apparently. Uh, devolve the game right? I think so. Damn wizard. Oh 
Fuck. Yeah, it is a good game so far, but it is somewhat difficult. <laughs> Quite a bit. Like that. <laughs> but it's still fun. Tough but fair. Yeah, I'd say so. Bastard. Let me pass. <laughs> I don't want to fight you. Well, that was dumb. Okay, well. Lost most of my health because of that. It's fine. I don't even care about those things anymore. I'm never gonna get them all. But yeah, the, the main mechanic about um, jumping is that you can... After you hit something with your sword, you can jump again. Uh, which is used quite a bit in the platforming. Like with those lanterns. And we also have a like, rope hook or whatever they call it to grab onto enemies or walls and things like that. This game is making me pain in my thumb from Hollow Knight Echo. It has a bit of that, I guess. Okay. Uh, shopkeeper? not touch as while the shopkeeper is away what do you mean this is exactly the time to touch things <laughs> you really thought it would be that easy hmm. just came back to stop me from doing that what a bastard can't even buy my upgrades Thought as much. We need to find his friends. Oh, he made it. Does this mean we can do the thing? Keep your hood on, Shorty. He still needs to pass the final test. But I want to do the thing. No, no. We need to see how tuned the to the scroll he really is. Great. Take it away, Prophet. <laughs> Welcome, messenger. Please hold the scroll aloft so that the prophecy might be fulfilled. See? Told you he was slow. Yeah, you weren't kidding. <laughs> Please hold the scroll higher than that so that the prophecy might be fulfilled. <laughs> oh? Um. Is this good or bad? Be messengers, him? Please pull this off. I really want to do the thing. I can't let the wait you, messenger. Should you survive, find us at the top of the Tower of Time. Tower of Time? Hmm. Interesting. But yeah, the music is great as well. Oh. Well then. 
So we go in there and it vanishes. Great. Oh my. What? What? Okay, that's better. I'm getting crypted the Necrodan survives from his music. Yeah, I can see that. really is a gauntlet, as they said. Oh. Oh. So this is where it kept leading to, I guess. The portals just kept leading to this place. I'm sorry, what? Ah yes, the big reveal. Indeed, my dear adventurer, you have been had been teleporting into this very room all along. So where are we? In the Tower of Time. And where is that? Surely you mean when? To be honest, I don't really know. The Tower is a device that travels through time. It manifests to test messengers who are deemed worthy in order to re relocate them as needed. Where will it take me? When? It will take you to the time most in need of a messenger. That is, if the Tower doesn't kill you, of course. Interesting. Um, checkpoints will now restore hit points up to five and refill all key charges. I think I will take that. Okay. Oh, I see. Okay. Wizard, can you leave me alone? that will work why am i okay that was that was dumb sorry <laughs> uh, how do lasers work Yeah, this place is really the gauntlet. There's... There's no doubt about that. It's way more difficult than anything else up to this point. Game for sure. 
Bastard Wither. Oh shit, I see now. Oh god, that's... That is very rough. Oh, come on. No! <laughs> I don't want to... No! Why is it so hard to just... There you go. on that? On... On the crystals? I don't think it does. What is this? Okay, never mind. Just a second. Wait. Never mind. <laughs> Close, but no cigar. Okay. It's very tricky. It really feels like all of this game so far has been child's play, and now we're actually getting to the real deal. Quite something. Ooh. Okay, never mind. I'm gonna go out of here. I'm I'm not ready. I'm I'm not ready for that. Uh. Wait, that's the the monk we fought, right? At the top. The corrupted messenger. Hmm. 
versus... Okay. Can we get a checkpoint? Please. I'd really appreciate a checkpoint. Well, there we go. This is a legendary hero, hero maybe? I think so. Wizards. It's Merlin. He's trying to kill me. Okay. Oh, why am I not using the you go. <laughs> Why did I forget I had that? I don't like that room. <laughs> I don't like that. This is cool though. I like this. Wait, I thought the shop was physically behind you, that other door earlier. Oh, so this is the moment that got you. My shop is connected all over the world and that's totally fine, but somehow it can't be in the same building twice. I can't believe you. made it through the test of will. Oh, we are so going to do the thing now. Prepare yourself, messenger, and behold the might of our order. You shall emerge as the chosen one, or not at all. Enough introductions, I'm going first. Well, someone's excited. I've been preparing this speech for decades and you just... You get over it, let's go. Is this a fight? Definitely a fight. Hello? Okay, so... Love that both designs are pretty. It is very cool. I like it. I didn't like that I just died by him clapping his hands though. <laughs> that wasn't the best.
<laughs> oh god. Okay. That's a rough fight. Uh, but how are you doing, trolls? Are you doing well? Did you win or die? I died. <laughs> I died. Damn it. Now I'm stuck doing this. Sorry, I mean, I messed it up so bad. Okay. Uh, I was being too reckless about that. I forgot to take the health. I think I forgot that last time as well. No. Well, let's try it again. I'll succeed one of these days, right? <laughs> Dancing. Oh, 
Damn it. I missed the chance. Am I... Oh, I'm confused. Thanks for the hydrate trolls. I'm a bit confused about that one. I'm did, did the platform like hit me in the face or something? I don't know what happened. I'm glad I didn't get cr crushed there. You'd think that would kill me. Oh shit. I messed up. I messed up. I messed up so bad there. Next phase? I don't know if there's more phases. <laughs>
So far so good. No health lost yet. As long as I get on one of the hands as soon as he finishes clapping, I should be okay. That was rough. <laughs> that was very rough. Okay, I think he's coming. Please let me do the prophecy bit this time. I'm staying out of this. Do whatever you want. Oh, and so you made it through the test of might. Okay, what's next? Uh, to fulfill the prophecy, you must now pass the test of faith by taking the leap. The leap? Um, the leap, yes. I don't get it. Well, test of faith, leap, leap of faith, makes sense, no? I would just jump already. Come on, I was trying to have an epic moment here. Um, now, hero, lend your courage to hope and your strength to purpose. Then dive into your destiny to emerge as the one true messenger. I guess. I guess that's what we're doing. Is this portal? Oh. Got a cool new outfit. And a new sword. Awesome. I think that's trademarked. I, I doubt that. <laughs> so, where do we end up? Or when?
still can't touch the cabinet even when I'm the true messenger now. What happened? I warmed or something and everything looks different now. Hello? Okay, that is a really cool hat. Seriously, wow. Any idea what happened though? Sorry, I, I just can't get over that hat. <laughs> when was this game made? I'm not sure. Um, let me check. It is 2018. 30th of August. 30th. So where are we? Welcome to the Cloud Ruins, remnants of a civilization of giants that used to live in the sky. This place is beautiful, but the structures feel precarious. Yeah, bad place if you're afraid of heights. How high on how high am I? You mean in my opinion? What? Oh geographically. Well <laughs> you entered the Tower of Time at the top of the mountain and then exited through the top of the tower. So I'd say fairly high. Enjoy the sights! What's the deal with everything looking so different? You know, I was wondering how you were going to deal with the implications of time travel. It seems ignorance really is bliss. Pardon? That moment in the Tower of Time? Yeah? It sent you to the future! Neat. Yes, precisely. Neat. Sure. So we're in the future now? Apparently. I guess. But I thought we were supposed to stop the Demon King. How can we do that if we're in the future? Or is, is the Demon King still here? See if I can do that jump. I don't think I can. I think that's just something you can't actually get to. like the spike wall things. That was a risk. <laughs> Walking on clouds. Hooray. Um. 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 <laughs> Sir? <laughs> Please? Please. 
Peace, Sir Dragon, sir. I would appreciate it if you didn't. Dragon. So cool hat. Oh, you like that? Is it why you chose to wear one as well? <laughs> this guy. What? Well, you have the same hat. No, I got it first. Oh, is that what you're going to tell yourself? Fine. I did have the hat first and you were all over it. Right, yeah, that all happened, sure. It's true though. Look, you can put your hat in the sand all you want in an attempt to preserve your ego, but clearly it's not going to work on the person that was there when it all happened. actually know what our goal is at the moment. Like we're in the future. Are we still delivering our message? I guess so. But wouldn't that make it a bit late <laughs> to have delivered the message? This I don't like. Okay. This is anyway. Checkpoint. need health if you fall to your death. That's true. That's true. Oh, 
come on. How did I miss twice? Oh well. You made it anyway. Is this another part with the dragon? Every time I forget to use the wingsuit. Dragon? No. Better? Nice. Survive the dragon once again. Oh, do you have any stories to share? Of course, here's one for you. There was once a starving mill boy who never missed a chance to help his fellow villagers. One day, after helping an old man carry a heavy bundle of wheat, he was offered a loaf of bread. Eat your fill, my boy, it's well deserved, he began. But if you feel like helping even more, there are two gnomes hiding in the forest who are even hungrier than you are. Now that boy was an empathetic one, his mind was made up instantly. After a short hike, he found the gnomes and split the bread between the two of them, without even saving a bite for himself. Thank you, kind little boy, the gnomes beamed. It seems you have lifted our curse. Indeed, to punish them for their greed, a spirit had put them under a rather annoying spell. They were exiled to the forest, carrying a magic little mill, capable of producing anything its bearer desired. But the little mill's magic would only be activated once the gnomes were fed by a stranger, acting out of selfless generosity. To starve while car carrying a relic promising abundance, a cruel fate indeed. Now you can imagine the little boy's surprise when he was given the magic item. Name something you want while turning the crank to the right, and the little male will produce an endless stream of it, the gnomes explained. Turn it to the left and it will stop. After creating a huge pile of food for the two gnomes and the the boy, uh, the young boy went back to his village to help the populace with his newfound powers. But as he grew in popularity, his older sister grew in jealousy. One night she couldn't take it anymore and stole the little mill from her brother's bedside table along with two leftover pies from that afternoon's feast. Adding insult to injury, she left on the family's fishing boat to reach new lands, hoping to help have her turn in the role of the popular purveyor. Once out at sea, she decided to try one of the pies, which to her taste were lacking a little something. What is even happening? <laughs> what is this story and why is it so long? It was time to try that little mill's magic, she reckoned. Give me salt, she said, turning the crank to the right. Oh, I, th I think I... Are we back in a few moments? Okay, or uh, see you in a bit. And salt she got. Heaps and heaps of it. Now, older sister had never bothered paying attention to how the mill could be stopped. Stop, little mill, stop, she shouted, first annoyed, then worried, and finally panicked. 
salt soon overflowed the boat itself, sinking it under the weight. It is said that the sunken little mill is still operational to this day, and is the reason why seawater is salty. The end. Yeah, I thought this that was where it was going. That was interesting, but it feels more like a kid's story explaining things about the world we know the actual reason for. Tough crowd, huh? Why don't you tell me a story and I'll judge it. So you're looking for additional takeaways? How about this? Seeing how Big Sister's anger led to her demise, irritated people were henceforth called salt to assault, <laughs> referred to as salty. Uh... Oh, we got another one. Seeing how Big Sister's shortcomings as a little mill operator led to her demise, unqualified people were henceforth referred to as not being worth their salt. Hey, this is fun. You should go. I'll keep on coming up with morals to do with salt. Great. All the salt-related puns and things. to risk this probably not probably not dragon welcome back oh, dragon dragon until next time oh boss fight I'm not sure what's up next but the prophet wanted me to repeat a line for you at this point in the adventure all right let's hear it okay I always wanted to try the voice check it out and on this day, the messenger shall unwittingly make his lifesaver indebted to, indebted to him. And that means? I'm not sure, but if all else fails, attack the fireballs. No, huh? good advice. Attack fireballs. Let me guess, it's the dragon. Hello, dragon. Just 
dragon is not the aim. Very nice. Oh. Damn it. 49 deaths. 49 in 3 hours and 19 minutes. Snoot. Dragon, be nice to me for once. Oof, okay, that was really bad. Damn it. Damn you, dragon. Why are you like this? One hit for one health is not good for me. No, <laughs> the exchange is not good. But I don't, I don't mean to exchange. I just mess up.
for you. Oh. That was rough. Oh, hey, Joe. Welcome. We're a ninja trying to kill a dragon. As you do. It's not a death simulator, trolls. <laughs> I do happen to die a lot, but... It's just how it goes in these types of games. Okay, that... That was... Really bad. <laughs> so why is there a built-in death counter? Because... You die a lot in these games? But it's, it's not... that doesn't make it a death simulator. and more? Maybe. I don't... I don't feel like I'm particularly good at this. <laughs> but it is also quite difficult. Like, I need to just stand there and hit him in the face. When I jump, I can't actually... Get hit, dragon. messed up the positioning a lot there. This is really rough because everything he goes through just vanishes so you have less platforms and if you, you haven't charged at you at the wrong angle then you have much less platforms to stand on. In this case it's pretty good because you'll start using the fireballs, so I can set him. He had those ninja bombs to chuck into its mouth. If only. All I have is shuriken, which, you know, aren't very useful in this fight. Okay, 
that was that was not worth it. That is a very rough one. So he destroys one side of the screen and then shoots fireballs from there. So you have to bounce on the fireballs and hit him in the face so that everything comes back, all the clouds come back. And then you can hit him again. But if you miss, if you miss the jump, then you die. Did you miss anything? No. Assume you haven't died at all? No, definitely not. Who would die in this fight? Come on. I'm not that bad. <laughs> in fact, who would die in this game at all? Such an easy game. You bastard. Cool. 
comes. Okay, then. Oh. Food dragon, yeah. I mean, all the, like, the bosses so far haven't really been bad, necessarily. I've been watching you for a long time, messenger. Who are you, anyway? Huh, so the disguise did fool you. It's a shame you freed my slave pet, but no matter. I'm now certain I can defeat you. It's the demon guy. Ninja Nick Fury. <laughs> Nick Nick Fury. I was like, who's Nick Fury? <laughs> hmm. Bahaha! <laughs> Surprised. Time to pay for what you did to my people. Bold words coming from such an unprepared adventurer. The underworld awaits you, messenger. At last, the scroll be will be ours. Watch your step now. So all this time, we were trying to fight the dragon and not fall down. We defeat the dragon and we fall down. I say we could have skipped this entire thing and just fallen down, but no. So this is the underworld, huh? It's not a bad place, lots of fire. Lava. This is fine. I say. But you didn't know where to fall down. Ah, that's true. Demon guy had to show me. Why am I thinking my wife would like it? Why am I? Why am I just incapable of hitting? Why is that so difficult for me? Come on, just. Harder than the bosses. Okay. 
I think we found a father's sauce in the pot. You're welcome. I even went down there. Or up there again. Listen in a pod from D. Uh I mean Fondue doesn't necessarily have to be cheese, I don't think, but sauce is also not <laughs> something you fondue usually. It is a kind of sauce, I guess. <laughs> Straight tomato sauce in a five gallon pot. I mean, I respect that. So. Tell me I'm at the current area. Welcome to the lion's den. Oh, I didn't see any lions. Though I meant... <sighs> Never mind. This heat is almost unbearable. Come on, I'm happy to avoid certain cliches, but to think we wouldn't have lava to end your epic quest is pushing it. Any stories to share? Of course, here's one for you. There once was a guy visited by a sec... Oh, actually. Should I... This might be a long story again. Far from being that kind of demon, she offered him a unique chance to visit hell as a tourist. Very adventurous by nature, he jumped right into the portal. They arrived in a room where giant cauldrons boiled over bonfires. They contained people, uh, they contained people where little demons with pikes were sitting on the rim to push anyone who tried to escape back inside. Who is in that cauldron? The man asked his succub succubus tour guide. This one? That's where liars and cheaters end up, she explained. And this one over there, she continued, that's for people who hunt for sport. Aghast, the man noticed another cauldron, much bigger than the other ones, and devoid of any demon sitting on the trim. Indeed, that one cauldron seemed to self-regulate. People were pull pulling back in anyone who tries to escape. And who is this cauldron for, he asked, curious as to who could be so stubborn in their ideology. They would rather hurt themselves than rethink their worldview. Oh, that cauldron? The succubus news? That's for the people who think the order doesn't apply anymore when a another line opens up at the mark. <laughs> um. Okay, now you're just using the platform to advance. What's wrong with you? Are you that guy? Which guy? The guy who's fifth in line but rushes to be first when a new line, line open up? Open up? Oh right, different timeline, never mind. Come on. Uh, I love the shopkeeper, he's great. That didn't help at all. I thought I could maybe jump after I hit it, but no. It only works with the sword. <laughs> I guess that's good to know, if anything.
a lot going on. But so far so good. Okay. Just don't get hit. No, it's fine. We healed up. It's fine. Looks like the demon general is next. Be careful out there, our year is pretty fast. Fast. I guess. I guess we have to be careful of him being fast. <laughs> No, we're left to run, demon. Why would I run? You stepped right into my trap. We'll see about that. <laughs> we end this now, champion of the blue robes. What are you gonna do? He likes his spinning blades. Dying on the first try is kind of expected on the that kind of stuff. Let's try again. Come on. do that. Hard fight. I don't know how to avoid some of the abilities, at least not very well.
one. to hit them. Why is this pattern so annoying? Like, the patterns of those demon guys make such a big difference. Like, they're, if they're in a nice pattern, it's pretty easy. If they're not, it's How did I get hit there? I think I want to attack him too badly. Sometimes I need to take a chill pill. <laughs> Chill pill seems like a good idea, I wonder what it looks like. Hell, true. To cool off. It would be great. Impossible. I'm the fastest there's ever been. Tell me how to end this curse or else. <laughs> is it that simple in your head, ninja? All of this is bigger than you or me. I'm ending this. Your demon king is next. Make no mistake, messenger. None of us are leaving this place alive. If I can't have the scroll, then it shall be destroyed. Um. Can you... Uh, okay, I guess... Down we go. 
Wait, what's further down than hell? Oh! Dragon! Dragon friend! Oh, Skull, I got you, buddy! Thanks, I guess we're even now. Oh yeah. What's your name? Manfred. What kind of name is that for a sky serpent? It's not my first name, but I always wanted to be a butler. Okay. Well, you should dress for the job you want and not the one you have, right? So? So, call me Manfred. Alright, Manfred, what did you do before the demon's mic controlled you? No time to explain, this is your big moment. You want a dragon butler? I do too. <laughs> I would love to have a dragon butler. Oh, there's the Demon King. Oh, were you hoping for the Western hero? No prophecies for you, worm. Prepare to die. Exactly the scene from the start of the game, except with a different guy you're protecting. Interesting. Except, yeah, and a, and a dragon instead of a bird, but you know, same kind of. You, I see, Barmathazel have failed me once again. The rain is over, despot. Oh, you think this is how it works? Know your place, ninja. Our curse is never ending and your time is up. As for you, soldier, I can't wait for my minions to make short work of you. That was amazing. You're the Western hero, right? No, I'm... Did I travel so far east that I made it back to my village from the west? <laughs> Everything's so different. It's Power of time really send me to the future? I guess this means... Hey, I have an important task for you, I think. Pardon? I mean, take this scroll. You need to carry it across the world to the top of the highest mountain. Really? I'm 100% down to leave this outpost. Yes, a messenger is needed. A messenger? Godspeed. What? Just take the scroll. like no NPC backstory for you. <laughs> yeah. So your time is the messenger is up. What do I do now? Well, you could take a few moments to appreciate the reveal that it was all just a loop. No way, I still want to be part of the adventure. Oh, we'll get right to that. What do you mean? I mean, it's time. Time for what? We need to finally open the cabinet. Really? Yes, go ahead and open it. Ooh, the cabinet. The mysterious cabinet. So, what do you what do you think is in the cabinet? Is it going to be like the the line the witch, witch in the wardrobe kind of thing? It's a whole new world out there. Let's find out. No. So, it's just a closet for blue robes. Why? Yes. What did it look like? Well, don't just stand there. Grab one of your size. Probably. Any job, bag and butler? I guess none of those things, just blue robes. It's really not that interesting, actually. I think I hear someone coming. Get behind the counter. I wasn't expecting you so soon. What is this place? This is the shop. Doesn't look like a shop. 
Okay, I set this. I, I mean, do I look like a sort of shopkeeper? What? Anyway, here's a power that will let you charge your beam. Oh, there's upgrades too. Sweet. <laughs> this, this game. What is happening? Oh. So thanks for the beam charger upgrade. You bet. You know, the way everything looks, I just felt like I should be able to do that. Yes, that's why Ray Troid invented it decades ago. <laughs> Who's Ray Troid? You were right, the new job. True! True. Who's Ray Troid? Just to follow up on an earlier joke. I... I don't get it. Some will. I do get it, you know. Everything alright? It's kind of boring, but I guess I'm okay. No, I mean, it's been a while since your messenger visited. Oh, I don't know. I, I didn't enter the shop so often myself. You're in the Tower of Time, remember? So? So it should automatically take you forward to in time to the next important moment. Which is, either your messenger enters the shop or dies. Oh? Did your messenger die? How would I know that? By using the scrying orb. If Quargle isn't sent within 10 seconds, your messenger dies for good. And when we were we be, <laughs> and when were you planning on mentioning that? Oh no! Oh no 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 no! We need to fix this. Oh, is it we now? Come on, now is not the time to argue. We have to look at this holistically. Look at this holistically? What does that even mean? It means I'm as lost as you are, but I still want to think I'm the smartest one here. I'll go fetch your scroll, hold on. What is... <laughs> what is going on? Be right back, I need to talk to the others. So, the messenger was supposed to guide as part of the cycle, has died. Which is a problem. Okay, we've reached an agreement. You're the one that needs to finish this. Really? Yeah, really. You weren't really fit to be a shopkeeper anyway. I'll leave the scroll here with your clothes. Come join us after you've changed. All I'm saying is, he's been carrying the scroll for a long time already and it could be dangerous. It is exactly as was foretold in the visions, a born again messenger will master time itself to end the curse by fighting in two cycles simultaneously. I don't know, wiping once to go to the future was risky enough. You think he can sustain doing that constantly? Well, unless you want to carry the scroll again, I don't see what other choice we have. Besides, we really need to find the remaining mu music notes. So you still believe the music box is important? Well, I am the prophet, right? So? So yes, I do believe in the prophecy. Well, if you really mean to help the messenger, try to tone down that wannabe epic tone of yours. <laughs> Careful, heathen. The mists of legend are very complex and attempts to trivialize their meaning may cause... Whatever, I'll, I'll be in my shop. feeling there are at least six more bosses. It looks like it, doesn't it? So the prophet will be your guide from now on. Good luck with that. Okay. Hello. Mm. And so the messenger rises once more. I'm not sure what I should do next. The mists of time are quite intricate indeed, but fear not, for the prof prophet is here to unravel their meaning. More like the interpret then, am I right? I, I will forgive this affront for those are these are troubled times. Behold, messenger, as the Tower of Time's portal nexus activates to help you on your quest. Return here whenever you seek guidance and I shall provide. Godspeed. 
Behold, the music box. The legend says that it is the very relic maintaining the curse on humanity. Okay. What is even happening anymore? So what do I do? Do I go into one of the portals? What if I just go the other side? What is this? Hey, it's you. I really miss that time when we did the thing. The others don't want to do it anymore. Welcome to the Tower of Time. I put it back in, into its headquarters from after you beat the challenge. Which I had designed myself, by the way. If you want to replay it, let me know. You may have missed a few hidden things. Ooh, you like that big portal? It's actually kind of scary. After years of research, I realized one of the items we need to recover is in the very future we are trying to prevent. If my calculations are correct, it should take you there, but in order to activate it, would need an, I would need a relic imbued with demon magic. Hmm. That hand, I've seen that before. Yeah, that's theirs. Like they, they, that's what he means when he says we did the thing. It was them. They were that boss. Can I actually go this way now? No. Well, let's just go into one of the portals and see what happens. Hey, you worked. Yeah, pretty neat. Things are probably going to get cryptic from now on with all this profit business, so you'll probably want to make extensive use of your map. My map? Your map, yeah. I don't have a map. Are you kidding me? I'm telling you, I don't have a map. Okay, let me get this straight. We gave you a scroll. The fate of this whole world seems to hinge on it. We gave you a hero title rel relating to it. You carried it for days across countless perilous situations, even through time itself. And you never even bothered reading it? You're an animal. Turns out the scroll was actually a map. <laughs> oh, I love the humor in this game. Once the bird returns to the nest, it shall learn the power of true sight. Okay. That's the prophecy right now. So I'm assuming we have to go back to the village. So where are we right now? I think... Oh, we're in the highlighted area, so we're right next to the village. I think. The, the pinkish area, all the way on the left. I'll be in my shop. If you have the coin, I'd be happy to mess with the prophet, the prophet by pointing out the hints on your map. Be safe now. Okay, well. Great start. Wait, how am I supposed to? Okay. Oh, come on. Come on. What am I? How am I that bad sometimes? So, 
Okay. Things have changed a little bit in the future, but a lot of it is still the same. Same monsters? Yeah, a little bit. There, there seemed to be a bit more, but maybe I'm wrong. There's some differences at least. So I can't actually... There. So this was just an extra thing, which is different from before. Wait. Since when can I do the backflip thing? <laughs> when did, when did this happen? do that before I don't know what that even does oh wait this is just because I'm I'm using the the cloak basically but I keep <laughs> just pressing the button and then yeah okay. I can see I see why it's happening I do as well. It looks really cool. Oh my god. Also, hello, X Men. It does a really nice effect to it. Want to try 
transitioning. It's great. So many things happening right now and I have no idea what's going on anymore. But I love it. We found a music note. Lovely. Key of Hope, materialized from the repeating intentions of countless villagers wishing their messengers well over past cycles, it is one of the notes needed to create a melody, melody that will break the curse. Thank you for the hydrate, Aura. This doesn't look too bad. Accidentally hit the spikes, but it's fine. So should we transition or not? Do we stay like this? No idea. I don't know if it matters. <laughs> village. Nice. Started at the tree all the way to the left side. I'm guessing that's what the prophecy meant. Oh, no. 
but we got something for it. Maybe we should go to the past. adventure treating you. A little bit harder than I thought, but the music is amazing. You left too soon. I should have thought taught you the power of true sight. True sight? It's a technique seldom taught to young students such as yourself. Unless the mind can be expanded, that is. How can I expand my mind? A warm cup of astral tea will do that. Unfortunately, we ran out of astral leaves a few years ago. All we have is a single seed. Fully growing it will take centuries. Well, we can travel through the future, so... Give me the seed, I'll see what I can do. I was hoping you would say that. Find a flower bed and wait a few centuries. Um, where's the f Where can I plant this? I don't know where to plant that. Where the sun shines bright and the mood is light, a little creature is paralyzed by fear. I'm missing something. <sighs> Finding a flower bed shouldn't be this difficult, right? Go to check. Mm. 
Yeah, okay, this it's far away. Never mind. So it's not in the village, that's all I was looking up. <laughs> Yeah, because we've. It, it's basically. The map is everywhere we've been already, except a little bit different. Like, there's some extra areas and stuff. So, there might be an extra area somewhere. But it said it was in. Searing Crags. So that's quite a way. Wait, actually, there were. What do you mean? There were. There were places to land in. I feel like I should have just gone through the portal and took a shortcut there. Find another portal soon. There are plant plants and places already visited. Might turn out to be spoilers. Uh, yeah. I don't, I myself don't really care too much about spoilers, but... As foretold by the mist, this portal shall be opened from the other side. Okay. Wait. So Glacial Peak... Would be closest? I guess. Note. As fate would beautifully have it, only by creating a melody from the crystallized forces of this world can the curse be broken. To complete the melody, we still need five music notes. Never mind. I just realized that was a that was a drop. I don't know why I thought that wasn't... There you go. Okay. and stuff. Wow, you took your sweet time, didn't you? 500 years. Do you have any idea how cold it is up here? Well, I, I'll leave you here. The messenger will need you in the future, he said. 15 minutes in, I was already cold and bored. Had I known it would take you centuries to show up, I... I... Actually, I'm kind of helpless. 
How are you supposed to help me? I'm not, not interested in wielding a necromancer weapon. I don't know, Ruxton got obsessed with the blue robes history. Is that something about how a tower you used to get to the clouds wouldn't be here anymore? So my epic contribution after waiting for centuries in the cold is apparently simply to beam you up and down as you please. To the cloud ruins? Yeah, that sure come in handy. Can we go now? You really think I'd be sitting here if I could teleport? Only you can activate my magic. For that you need Ruxin's amulet. Okay. And where would I find that? Of course I would die there. Let's try that again. I'm not sure if I should have gone back. Being unsure if I need to be in the future or the past makes me make mistakes so many times. Oh, come on. Give me health. Thank you. Embarrassing story. The elemental skylands are in danger. I need your help. The elemental skylands? Yeah, they regulate the climate in this little world of ours. If you don't take care of it soon, you'll find the demon curse to be the least of your concern. Okay, I'll try to find some help. I'll be here. Poor dragon butler, yeah.
And we're back here. Why am I... Just failing so hard on this. Let's just do this. Doesn't matter, I'm bad either way. Doesn't matter. Ice in video games always have so have to be so bad to deal with, so frustrating to deal with. Checkpoint. Another equip the non slip tonic. <laughs> it's a different game. Sometimes. I'm just like, okay, I'll see you guys. Just fall down, fall down. Oh wait, that's not a spot I can actually fall down. We actually have to climb down. Even though we didn't really climb, we just jumped off anyway. But hi guys. Your flower bed? Oh! Right. Once our thistle is fully grown, we'll add it to our shoe and see how strong it makes us. We said it to this I call it colors. Yeah, I remember now. What's up, little guy? Can I use a corner of your plant flower bed? I have a seed of plants. I don't see why not. Concerns, Carlos? Mix. Sorry. I don't remember. Be our guest, little guy. Thanks. Okay, now we just need to go to the future. Yes. Yeah, I had forgotten about it as well. Thank <laughs> you. 
Damn it! Okay, I'll do it this way. Thistle. Time to prevent two dumb brothers from waiting to their death. And astral tea leaves. Ninja elders should know what to do with these. Good enough would be helpful down there. I'll, I'll try. Go back to that. So let's give them their uh, power system. guy again. What's up? I have your power system. Huh? Hey, he's not kidding, Cola. So he sees Susan's. Never mind how you pulled this off, little guy. Throw it into the stew. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, Cola? Oh, this is where it gets serious, Susan. It's chugging time. Well then. Still full. <laughs> Is that the magic cauldron? <laughs> I'm satiated, Susus. I'm content, Colos. Shall we test how strong it made us, Susus? It's all I crave, Colos. Don't move, little guy. Well, now I need some sleep, Susus. I reckon, Colos. Thanks for everything, little guy. Wait, where? Where did they throw us? It's 
not where but when, I know. It's <laughs> a one way path. That's nice. Is there like one in each area or something? Key of strength. Forced into being by Colos and Zeus's physical feats is one of the notes needed to create a melody that will break the curse. Just need four more. Um, I guess there's a dead live foe turned friend left an important item. So the underworld, I guess. site. Should be able to get it soon. And then probably after I get that I'll have the shoes. Um, I 
because I need to have some dinner. I mean, that's my, it's my own mistake always, but <laughs> I feel so dumb when I just run into enemies. Yeah, so often. Wrong button. Wrong button. Because I, I thought I wasn't going to make it, I actually made the mistake of falling down. I'm rushing too much, aren't I? I like the style change. It's very nice. Also getting close to the 1000 time charge I need for the last upgrade. For the hydrate here then. Uh, um wait, did I need to No there was a portal here, right? I think. Yeah there it is. Welcome, young adventurer. Greetings, Elder. I got the tea leaves. An impressive feat. It would seem you have mastered time itself. Ah, to taste astral tea once again. You have brought an old man great joy. Thank you and farewell, brave messenger. Yes? You were supposed to use the tea to expand my mind and got me the power of true, true sight. Ah, yes, the power of true sight. Apologies, as it ages, the mind tends to err. Err, indeed. Here's a candle for you. You got the power of true sight. Or in other words, an ordinary wax candle. What? <laughs> if you ever enter a very dark place, this should help you see at least a very little bit. Elder. 
I mean, I, I assume it really helps, but <laughs> it's just calling it true sight is it's just not right. years to get a candle candle how efficient yeah very efficient uh, okay I'm assuming the game saves automatically because it keeps saving so I assume it's just saved um, let me see who is streaming um, Andy is streaming Rocket League. Could do that. I don't know how long he'll be going still. Because he has been going for five hours. We can do a no raid. Um, Wait, the trolls? Oh no, trolls is a rerun. It's like trolls are alive, but it's it's a rerun uh, thing. Okay, let's raid Andy. I don't think I've raided Andy before, but yeah, he's playing Rocket League. Should be fun. Uh, really enjoying the messenger so far. Really cool game. Um, a bit frustrating sometimes but that's just how these games are um i really love the humor in it and everything so uh we'll definitely be playing more of this um we'll be back tomorrow with more of this <laughs> so uh hopefully i'll see you then but go say hi to andy and um yeah just have a nice week um, hopefully i'll see you next time goodbye